Right, okay. I really thought I'd seen the maximum terrorism potential in football from Pochball. But Jesus Christ, Gareth Southgate, you have absolutely, you've taken Pochball, you've fisted it out of the water. That is the most disgraceful performance I have seen in a long time. With the players we have, we should be beating every team in that group at least 3-0. You know, or we'll allow, we'll allow the 3-1 just in case a, like, a good goal, like the goal that happened in this Denmark game happened. This is disgraceful. I don't know what tactics, if any tactics at all even you're dishing out, they're just wrong. Everything is wrong. The substitutions for the most part, wrong. The only substitution that made sense at all was the Gallagher substitution and the Eze substitution. And that's over both the games. The Gallagher substitution makes sense because of energy. Because that's what that's the one thing he's bloody good at. Eze was needed because Foden's been utter shite the, both these two games. Honestly, it just makes no sense. How do we expect to win anything under him? If we do win this Euros, it is an absolute scam. And I question what the hell has happened in this time. But it, I'd honestly... Honestly, this game... The whole England team... The, the, we were playing a game of walking football. I played football yesterday. And I spent most of the time walking. You know why? Because my ankle was absolutely fucked. And to tell you what, I probably put in more energy into that than I than this. He is disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Kane, other than the goal, invisible. Foden, invisible. Saka was alright. The fact that Bowen got subbed on, fucking disgraceful. Eze had moments, but still was a bit shaky. John Stones, why is John Stones not be doing what he does for Man City and pushing himself up? So at least Rice and... Trent and Belling or whatever can do their stuff. Speaking of Rice, Rice has been n not good these two games. I don't care what people are saying. If that was, I don't know, just anyone else even. He's just not been good enough for what we should expect. Trent, not been good enough. I don't know why this, this midfield shit needs to stop. Start the game off with Mainu or Gallagher. It will just make us so much better. Trippier. I pray to I, I just pray to something or someone or just anything that Luke Shaw is fit for uh, Tuesday I think is when we next play. And, oh, it's just disgraceful. It actually is disgusting. It is generally if you look at vomit, you'd pick the vomit. Oh, like you'd rather drink the vomit. They get you've just seen some like homeless guys had these like temp beer of the day sitting on the benches in your local town centre than that South Gable. That is the kind of situation this is. It is diabolical. It is disgusting. The only person today who I think had a good game or like couldn't really do much more is Jordan Pickford because he could not save the goal because you know that was a brilliant goal by the Denmark player. I forgot who it was but yeah great goal and you know the only other really like decent player like uh, Jude spent most of the game walking about like an idiot Mark Gay he had a bit of a shaky few shaky moments towards the end he's probably the only other player I'd say who's been good that's all I can say really Watkins had you know got into good positions but yet yeah, no one just wanted to pass forward it was the 92nd minute and Trippier with loads of space around him decides to just pass back and rightfully got booed by the crowd because of it. It is disgusting. There needs to be... Like, Slovenia, technically, are the weakest of the three teams. If we mess this up, who knows what will happen. That's all I can really say. Anyway, that's all i really got to say for this video. It's not going to be a long one. It's just... It, it, Southgate out. But generally, it is disgusting. He's been here for eight years, almost. I think it's eight years. Yeah, that that's disgraceful. That is disgraceful. That's yeah. Bye.